Alright, everyone. I want you all to come to Jack Games. Do you understand me? Yeah, or I'll turn you into chocolate and eat you. <laughs> This is Jeremy, owner of Jack Games, JC Games, and Brandon Foda here with a box opening of the new Heroes Clash from My Hero Academia. Uh, hope you guys are excited as I am. We got these new Chrome Rares we're trying to get. I heard uh, two people, well, one guy pulled two Chrome Rares. <coughs> Let's get into it. Let's see if you can pull one. Seem that energy, guys. And ladies, of course, let's open it up. So what they did was the distributor had given us um, had given us like half and half, right? So since I was a bundle A, they gave me like half first edition packs and half unlimited. I guess because what happened was it's, it's uh, the, the comb rails are serialized, right? So there's uh, 100 of each, right? I think there's five. So it should be 500 in circulation amongst all the first edition boxes. So this is box number two out of my case. Uh, the first box opened up a secret rare, so see the chroma in this one. <clears throat> see, we see a, bo a box hopper here. Oh wow, no, it's okay. Okay, this is the cool code you get uh, to go ahead and like. Uh, I think it's for the game. So it took up a lot of memory, so I still gotta download the game. But it's the code for the game. And all of a sudden, it looks like we got a XR UR. So we got the tattoo, tattoo thrashing, which is perfect. Cause I actually pulled one in, a, in, in another box, so I'm pretty happy about that. <coughs> all right, so that's awesome. I do play tattoo tattoos, so I'm pretty cool with that. Uh, we'll open the court pads uh, probably halfway through this this box opening. I'm gonna go ahead and cut the tops of each one, just so it's a lot. It's a little easier to, uh, I guess, to kind of go through and see the cards. All right, We're pretty much only mainly looking for the money cards, so just the rares and the XRs in the back. I'm sure you know everyone else wants to see what we pull, but you know what's important is, is that money card, right? So also, guys, make sure you keep your packs because uh, that's where the money's at. <laughs> well, not money, but you get to turn your packs in for the promos, right, and for redemption. So keep your packs. If not, send your packs to me, right? Maybe I'll pay you guys like five bucks for packs or something like that, huh? All right, so I'm just, like, I'm, I'm just opening these up real quick with the scissors. I am not looking at the cards. To keep the integrity of the open right? it would be nice to see if the chrome wares were if they you know if they, if they weigh different but uh i don't know well, i guess we'll find out yeah so we got the previews coming up here uh, this friday october 14th so tomorrow uh if you guys want to come we're in brandon florida uh jsc games suite 201 come up here and play some uh play play some right here with us we were actually uh, very lucky to be chosen to run the provisional store championship. So super pumped about that. We actually got our cards in from Jasco the other day. So uh, if you want to come for that, that is going to be October the 22nd. We're going to be running that. And uh, myself be playing. I'm kind of in a toss because I've been playing Jiro like all the time, right? But Jiro online, it just seems like she's super nerfed. But in person, I feel like you have a good shot. And it's kind of hard because I've been trying to lead in towards playing Jiro on, on the all symbol. Because <clears throat> I think a lot of good attacks are on the all symbol. But the foundations, to me, just don't seem as good as playing on the good symbol. I just don't like playing on air. You know, air got a lot better, I think, in this set. So we'll we'll see how it goes. All right, everybody. This That was the last of our packs. Let's open up. So we'll go with the vibe, probably the, the the first one or so. I'll go through the first couple and then we'll go through there. You got cool and tough. Easily excited. I know it's a little hard. I don't know why it's so far, but uh, uh, trap flex, idle work, prehensile tell, ectoplasm clones, constantly improving. Uh, Shoji. Art of the Student and Talented Baker. So pretty pumped about this one. Because uh, it should be a pretty good card. I saw uh that dude's name is uh, Tam. He was playing this card and it seemed really good. So maybe Jiro on the all symbol might actually do some work with this card. 
keeps like auto focus or something, but yeah, pretty cool. We'll put the rares here <clears throat> so you can see, and then we we'll just put these, I guess, off screen. So from here on out, I'm just gonna go blunt, I'm just gonna run through it. I'm just gonna open one up, <clears throat> then we'll go right to the back, all right, right to the last card. Looking for that chrome rare. Remember, we're going right to the back, all right? So it looks like not an XR, but we got one with nature. So got a question about this card here. So it seems like it says uh, enhance this car one card from our, uh, this car one card rivals block modifier to blocks attack is plus two, which is nice because I play on the good symbol. <coughs> Response though, once per enhanced step, after any after you discard any any number of cards, your attack gets plus one damage. So I wonder if that enhanced stacks from once you discard it from the first one. I guess it probably doesn't because each enhanced step, you know, is, is a new, you know, is a new step, I guess, right? Probably doesn't, but still not bad. Not bad if you're playing the good symbol, if you're playing Toru, you know, the blog mods get hard already. So my, my thought process is to go into Jiro, to play Jiro, and then go into um, Toru too. All right, to the last, oh, we got an XR this time, no hoist. We got a rare uh, freezer burn, and we got an XR common, Shadow's Aid. I'm thinking about playing this Tokiyami on Chaos, man, with the allies, <clears throat> and maybe playing a Kodo, a Kodo. That could be a nice little thing. <coughs> All right, no Chrome Rares yet. No Ultra Rares yet, except for the Box Topper, which is a super plus. All right, going to the last two again. All right, uh-oh, I think we got what we wanted. Oh, yes, I've been wanting this card so bad, that flex show might. Love it, on both Jiro symbols, man, all in good. <coughs> I'm thinking, <coughs> excuse me, I'm thinking about playing this card because Jiro's gonna use this card to advantage. We're gonna play it on our first form. We're gonna slap this down. We're gonna show them our six difficulty attack. I mean, six difficult, I mean, uh. Six damage attack and draws two cards. Or just see attack out of their hand, right? They're gonna see a block zone, so that's not too bad either. Either way, it saves in the card pool, and it just gets plus one, plus one to, you know, to our weapon or to our uh, charge attacks. Okay. But the last card in this one is Cheerleader. Also pretty cool. I love playing Flash. There is this card, though, that, because so, 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 hear me out, hear me out. I love playing Flash, right? So, so Chile says response remove. Discard one momentum. After an attack is played against Flash. I'm thinking Flash on my turn, right? And it has a, a, a Kragre response. The card I'm thinking about playing to give my cards Flash is this one. It is a sudden appearance, right? So cheerleader, you have to remove it and this card momentum to give a card Flash, right? That's on both players turn. But on my turn, which I would like because I'm playing Jiro, I can enhance your attack, flip this card in this enhanced step. So I could go ahead and buff capture net, you know, something like that to give it, you know, speed damage, speed damage, and then go ahead and flip this and then, and then um, just send it. So now that's a flash attack, right? Because they have no enhances. That's what I'm thinking in my head. It might be a good play. All right, uh, go ahead and pull the last two. Looks like it was a uh, Odro. Then we got a rare Deku's Notebook. Not too bad. So we got one ultra rare so far. All right. Uh, the last two. The Tentacle Slice. And oh, whoa. This is a secret rare, right? The SR? I don't think I've seen it before. Aggressive Clash. So cool. So hey, this will be a second secret rare you put out of that box. Okay, very well out of the case. So this is pretty cool. I don't play the I play the dip symbol, but that's awesome, man. Um, very powerful two punch slam, enhance. Uh, discard one card, destroy one rival foundation with the keyword. That's like everything. <laughs> if this attack is blocked, both players shuffle all cards from the discard pile into the decks, and both players reserve the reveal the top card of the decks. That's kind of weird. I know this card's gonna be good. I just wanna see how it's good right now, right? It's definitely gonna be, be good in later. Uh, Fastest of the game, cards that maybe manipulate drops or get the draw a lot. So go to the last two cards. So we got an XR. Noise. 
So we got an X star star deck endeavor. I love, I love characters at XR. That's really cool. And we also got Heroes um, Inspiration, so that's pretty awesome too. A symbol they're shared with all and good with Jiro. This is a card I might look at too. I heard this guy in the comments one time. He was saying, though, enhance, add this card to your carpool, draw one card. So you can enhance, add this to your carpool, um, one attack, and then just go ahead and build it down with Capture Net. So you get to draw a card, and you get to build it back down with Capture Net. So it's a, pretty much a plus one. And, it, you know, it's pretty cool. Let's see what last two. We got a Coda attack. Command Pigeon Flock. All right, come on, guys. Where's the energy at? You haven't pulled. Did we pull one you are, I think? We slacking here. We got another rare, UA High. I haven't got this one, it's a terrain. Uh, when this card is in your stage, at the end of the, each player's turn, that player may draw one card and discard one card. Enhance or move, add one ally card from this card pile to your hand. Could be decent on the, uh, <coughs> on the uh, uh, chaos symbol, but it's a three difficulty uh, 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 asset, so it's a little costly. Next pack, let's go to the last two. Oh, we got an XR, okay. We have an XR, so we have Karate Chop is our is our base rare, and then we have an XR common. We have Forceful Blow. This actually looks pretty good. I know you maybe can't see the the shine on it, but it looks really nice actually. I like when cards are full art. Just my to my like. <laughs> All right, next pack. Come on, Chrome Rare. Oh, not a chrome rare, but we got the stun grenade. So pretty good you are. So mm, pretty happy about this one. Just gonna move these cards over here, huh? We'll probably do like two more and then we'll open up these uh, core packs. Alright, next pack. I'm trying to keep the video short for you guys. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. sudden death assault. Man, Sugar Rock is gonna get so much play this set. I'll play him too. And the death symbol is so good. Uh, and someone was saying it's a charge too. So if you're playing Chaos, you can run it with um, um, uh, that four drop um, or Chaco card. Double jab pummel. Just nasty with it. And the last two. No XR this time. But a good rare. Conflict of Ideologies. Not a bad card at all. Pretty sweet. Sorry I'm not giving you guys too much detail, I'm trying to make it short, but uh, don't worry man, there'll be tons of videos coming out here, tons of deck lists, uh, locals be popping off, we're going to record a lot of videos, so just stay tuned, and sorry channel's been like, kind of kind of up and down, just been busy, alright, next pack, okay, oh, laceration, not bad, I don't think I, I, think I pulled this card before, it's a stain rare, nice, alright, cork pack number one, Oh sweet backdraft! I'm thinking about maybe building this card on um on uh, on, on Earth, man. Cause enhance I'm mean, not Earth, but good. See, the enhance commit one foundation. This attack gets minus one speed. If it's a fire attack, it gets uh additional minus one speed. So maybe on Earth, maybe water would be probably more more suitable for defensive capabilities. But we'll see. Next one is Death Arms. So now this guy is nasty. Like, oh boy, this guy on death, I think it's gonna be nasty. I saw some dudes, uh, one of Tam's decklist videos, and someone built this. And I was like, man, this is pretty nasty. You know, all these five different attacks, you know, uh, especially on the death symbol, just siding, like you said, siding to this, siding to no move, you know, siding the Sugar Rocky. I like playing, uh, I, I like playing snipe, just snipe them out, win game one, the game two, sign of this, and now they just did, did. Sounds pretty fun. All right, next pack. That was all the cork packs. Still chasing the, uh, still chasing the little uh, chrome rare. I want just so I can see what it looks like, what it feels like. <clears throat> all right, so we got a pretty good UR here. You got a Force Whirlwind, not too bad. I still want, I still want the uh, the uh, Toga UR, and I still want the the Dobby UR. But hey, might be one of these packs. Go ahead and get these last two, see if we get the XR or not. We did not get an XR, but we got a hardened uppercut. Not too bad. 
Maybe on Earth, this car might be good, especially in Kirishima. Most cars that have people's faces on them tend to be pretty good and built for that character. <coughs> All right. Go ahead and get these last two so you get this XR in there. Uh, I think we got the last two. We may got an XR in here. Uh, we got recovery, or recovery time and XR uh, conflict of ideologies. Only difference I can see is maybe the foil looks a little different. It's not even full art, unfortunately, huh? Let's go look at the other one, actually, and see if she actually pulled both. Okay, yeah, so pretty much all I can see is the XR. The XR is closer, is, uh, I guess it would be to the left of the camera, so it's this one here. This is the XR, and all I can see is the middle part, the middle portion here, seems to have, like, a little more, like, squared foiling than this one does. Unfortunately, it's not, you know, it's not uh, full art, but I'll play the XR anyway. All right, we got about five packs left. Come on, Chrome, where are you in here, right? Whoa, ho, ho, nice, though. I, I've been wanting this one. This is the Forced Attack. So I'm thinking about playing on the All Symbol, maybe with the, um, uh, the die who stuns a lot, the Sugar rush guy forget his name playing with me with him having stun 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 and then playing something like this right or playing on the life symbol right playing back alley you know what i mean and all the mids now nah, i like to play flash attacks i don't know man i think a punch package might be good and all might leaves his card too and punch in there huh put that mighty punch i think mighty punch is a mid all right see last two so you get xr on that we did not get an XR, but we got Influencing the Youth. It's a rare, not too bad. It's a four check though. I mean, yeah, so it's a four check. So it's not, you know, you gotta be wanting to get it, right? Wanting to play it. All right, we got three packs left. This is uh, second to last, fourth to last. Good Jiro Foundation, think about running it. And we got another rare, Friend of Animals. Okay, okay. Three packs left. Hopefully the Chromer is in here. I'd be upset the Chromer was like actually inside the like not the last ones, but it's all good. I mean, we'll see what it is. Uh, last two. No, looks like but we did get a rare. We got nullified. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take that. It's an action. The one where you get to like kind of pretty much cancel your uh, character's abilities. It's pretty cool. All right, second pack and then one left. XR, dang, no XR. To the rescue, again, sharing two Ajiro symbols, huh? This one might be pretty cool too. Uh, so this is on a rival's turn, this is good for defense. It's an offensive card. All right, last one, everybody, wish me luck. Dang, no Chrome Rare. But we did get a UR, so that's pretty cool. We got the Wind. Uh, yep, Wind Up Punch. All right, everyone, that concludes this video. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe because I want to hear what you guys got to say about the My Hero card game. Just putting these out here so you can kind of look at all the pulls we got. There is no order for real, it's just kind of just spaced out. You can kind of see. Let me run out of space. <laughs> we'll put a little more over here, right? I guess. Maybe slide. Yeah, just slide them off. Yeah, just slide them off. But I do like the XR, uh, the XR um, character though. So that was pretty sweet. I'm happy I got that part. <clears throat> All right. So based on this, I think the one that looks the best to me. You know, I'm kind of privy to this uh, XR Endeavor. Looks pretty awesome. Stone Grenade looks pretty good too. I'm a sucker for the purple <laughs> card, so Sugar Rocket looks pretty cool. And actually, um, for, uh, Force Attack looks pretty cool too, actually. I like how it's spiraling and everything like that. But all right, that concludes the video. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that like bell. Don't hit it, but take it out to dinner. And then when you're, li then when you're with dinner with the uh, like button, make sure you tell the like button that you're already taken. And you just got dinner so you could use them for their money. Kind of shady.